it takes 22 cows to make the footballs for the Super Bowl. Oh, this is unimportant. Guaranteed to not change your life. This is the Unimportant Podcast. Welcome to the Unimportant Podcast. My name is Joe Bob. That is Anthony. Uh, and today we're talking about the most... Wa- Actually, no, I don't think it, the Super Bowl is the most watched globally. Because I think that's like the World Cup. Uh, yeah, I think you're it, right. It, but the most watched American television Definitely. show uh, in in the country. Yeah. Yeah. And it requires 22 cows to put on. Yeah. I, well, you know, the dancing cows that come out in the halftime yeah. show. That's what you're talking about, right? No. Oh, interesting. No, okay. I, I was referring to the the 22 cows that sacrifice their lives to provide the footballs. <laughs> Sacrifice is an interesting... <laughs> I don't think they have a choice. I mean, no, they're not given a choice. This is already kind of a weird episode. <laughs> Jeez. All right, um, so we're talking about cows getting slaughtered. Yeah, Continue, so, go ahead. So Wilson, the company Wilson, makes mm-hmm. footballs for the NFL. They've been doing so since 1941. Yeah, and Tom Brady deflates them. Yep, definitely. Um, so um, Wilson spokesperson Kevin Murphy um, recently did an interview and just talked about the details of why like would he do why would he agree to that i don't know that to I, give us content i don't know <laughs> <laughs> yeah seriously so every cowhide that they um use makes about 10 footballs whoa how what wait so what how many footballs do they make for the the super bowl we're, Are you we're about that? to go into that Jeez. how many do you think it is well now i think i know like 220 216 footballs why each team gets 54 practice footballs and 54 game day footballs. No. They also, the teams receive them within 24 hours of winning their respective AFC or NFC championship games. Okay, so, the, so they're, they're in delivered a, immediately. They're in a place and they get shipped this the Overnighted, day. right away. Wow, to the, to the team. That, that was, seems like a lot. Why do they need 54 I game balls? My guess is, one, you do not want to be in a situation... Where you don't, yeah, you, you don't, don't have, have one. I think they That's also, excessive. I think they also probably give a bunch away. Probably. After, after memorabilia, we'll, yeah. they're going to the Hall of Fame. Yeah, they're, well, I feel like it's they less. They let the teams, you know, keep game balls and. Oh, and two, I feel like, you know, if, if you say you're a fan that gets a, a field goal that strays to the oh, yeah. right or left and you you, oh. you catch that ball awesome i would think that's awesome but not after they i know they make 216 of them like yeah that's cool. true <laughs> great i got the super bowl yeah. football yeah and, well, no <laughs> a, a super bowl football. Is that, how many how many do you know how many they have during a regular game because, i do be, because i when i was a kid i was at a chargers game and it, it was a game early on in the season they forgot to raise the netting behind the field goal post the kid next to me and me. Who's in charge of that, by the way? It's probably some like 18 year old intern. Oh, yeah. I, I don't think that's a really <laughs> highly coveted job. The, the kid next to me got caught, caught the football like next, it, like, and both very excited. And somebody came up and took it away from him, said, oh, got, You got to give it back. Which, to, oh, in so hindsight, like, now that they know, well, and this is pre Cam, Cam Newton giving footballs away to kids. This is like, oh, yeah. yeah, this is. 15 oh no way i'm giving that back yeah years ago 15 20 years ago i'll watch the rest on tv i'm out of here (laughs) (laughs) so okay continue so um wilson refuses to i don't know about refuses but does not announce how many cows they use during a season how many cow hides but we can do some simple math and figure out you didn't acknowledge acknowledge my slurping yeah it wasn't yeah, no, I did not. I, <laughs> okay, no yeah. slurping in dollars. So, here. so how many, how many, how many cows so, does this awful company slaughter? <laughs> Why would you? Okay, just from a PR perspective, like we both work in marketing. Yeah. In what world do you think it's a good idea to come out and actually say all of this stuff? My guess is they were pressured to do so, and so okay, so so here, best case scenario, the people that are interested in this sort of stuff go, okay, cool, and the people that are super far for the animal rights thing are just mad at you. Oh, yeah. like, th- what good comes out of doing this no interview? Idea. No idea. <laughs> okay, go ahead. Anyways, so uh, Wilson doesn't talk about how many even footballs they make for the NFL and certainly mm-hmm. not how many cow hides for those reasons. Yeah. But um, the NFL rule book states that um, a home team for an outdoor game must provide 36 footballs for the game. Wow. Um, a home team for an indoor game must provide 24. Jeez. So if we want to figure out one, how many footballs per season, okay. and then how many cows, of oh, course. Oh, jeez. Um, you just got to add it all together. Yeah, but so we're just going to say, I think more NFL games are played outdoors, obviously. So yeah. we're going to use the number 32. 
Okay. okay. Just to, it's like more towards 36 yep. than, than 24. I understand how numbers work. Yeah. So 16 games are played every week. Okay. Um, times 32 footballs. Jeez. Is 51 cows a week. Whoa. Six, this is 16 depressing. weeks. I am not like a, you 820 know. cows. That's lo- not the playoffs. I and lo- the 216 and the Super Bowl. We're looking at 12 to 1400 cows. I, I love hamburgers and I love steak, but this is, you're just, to your dude, point, talking about actually just, okay. To your point, how many cows do you think are consumed during the Super Bowl? During the Super Bowl. Oh, wow. Okay. So from my hand, I, I don't know, but I was just wondering. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> you had that I number. I bet it's what more. We, I bet we, it's more. What was the episode where we talked about people eating stuff during the Super Bowl? What was, oh, salsa. Yeah. No, salsa? Mm, Tacos. Hot dog. I don't know. Hot, hot dog. It's got to be hot. One of those P- things. Pizza. Oh, it's pizza. pizza. It's like one yeah. in three people watches a Super Bowl consumes, consumes pizza. pizza yeah. So like, or maybe that, it's half. I don't remember. Yeah. It was, it's somewhere like that was months ago. 60 million people eat pizza during the Super Bowl. And Nuts. I bet I bet it's somewhere around there. Like yeah. you know, people same people are eating hamburgers. Probably. Jeez, man, that's this is this is depressing. Is it over yet? Um, no, let's go. So well, let's lighten it up a little. Great. Um, so uh, Wilson produces all of their footballs in their factory in Adna, Ohio. Okay. Um, they've got 120 people making footballs there. 120 people to make foot. Well, I guess yeah. If you're that Only many footballs, two of them are allowed mm-hmm. to even look. What? At the NFL footballs. Really? Oh, so, so you're talking you are, about Wilson's entire plant. Yes. So there's two people that manufacture all of the footballs. You for the are NFL. required to put in at least 20 years of service before Whoa. you are allowed to even be considered that to work on NFL footballs. That, I mean, that makes sense. How because, cool is that? Well, but you also got to consider the like. It, that's a big contract that Wilson oh, gets. Yeah. And if that contract goes away, oh then, yeah. I mean And just the marketing. I mean Oh like, totally. It's like when from uh, being on TV when week. Nike picked up the NBA jerseys yeah. contract, like they uh, who was it Adidas? I I'm, I'm, I forget who it was actually I making it, it, but whoever took the hit of losing the NBA jersey contract. Yeah, seriously. Yeah. So um, I, I guess I fired. I guess I wouldn't mess around. Like if this, you know, I would I would put the two most trustworthy people on to seriously servicing seriously. essentially the biggest account we have seriously. but yeah okay, that makes sense so why are they made of leather like nba basketballs are actually made out of synthetics now oh they are no way they are i didn't know that they are huh. um a lot of other sports are played you know tennis all these other sports are played with um, yeah, tennis balls are not made of leather yeah i think we're all aware i'm of that. just i'm just saying <laughs> i'm just saying it's feasible that nfl like why can't the nfl use synthetic footballs and because save all the cows but there's, a, there's a real reason. Well, because one, I can feel the difference. I am not an NFL quarterback and I hate not playing with leather balls. Yeah. <laughs> um, so Wilson said basically about that, that um, it, well, it says leather mimics the skin. So it adapts to weather changes by contracting and expanding depending mm-hmm. on the conditions. Yep. Um, for sports like basketball, which is played inside, synthetics are viable, but not for outdoor sports. Mm-hmm. Um, he did say though that leather is not an option today, but it, doesn't mean it won't be in the future. Interesting. So it looks like they are working on plans to develop new materials Which and save the cows. I don't mind. I don't mind that at all. That's not a. That's not a thing. That yeah. I why wonder not? The, the NBA when they play the outdoor games. I wonder if that. You know, there's like one big stadium game that they play. Like, oh, every yeah. Year. I wonder if that the NCAA that plays on an aircraft carrier every year. Yeah, yeah. I wonder if the synthetic is. Uh, we're getting way too far into this. This is unimportant. Thanks for tuning into this episode of the podcast. If you want to make a difference, change the world probably listen to something.